option one. The floor is lava. We defended this guard from warrior. Now we have to dispose of him. First we knock him into the lava. And then we mind control him so he stays there. The good thing on the lava is uh, that it damages friends and enemies alike. So even under effect of mind control, the enemy still takes damage. Uh, as you can see, I jumped into lava as well. So if warrior charge me, he is still in lava and dies. Yeah, like this. And now we will check another silver shards mines, where I will have some fun with uh, demon hunter and death knight. Problem is he is mounted, so I use netomatic 5000 to dismount him. And now mind control to put him in lava. Uh, the problem with demon hunters is he has a lot of flight abilities, but. I have mind control. Oh, and he used the dash, but on the wrong side because it was one second before mind control. And is he getting out? Yes, he is getting out. Not. Now we have to get rid of that knight. First, I knock him into the lava. Oh, he is anti magic shell. Um, looks, it works against lava as well. Seems like lava is magic after all. Mm. Anti magic off. Oh, he has the one minute auto trinket. Now he used Lich Board. So I use Shackle Undead. And wait for cooldowns. Oh, there is diminishing return. At this point, he should have just run away. Oh, and I will have... Yeah, now is the last chance for him to run away. But no, he stayed, so... I knock him to the lava and... He is dead. I need to target something first. Option 2. The Abyss. First, I will use the Invisibility <laughs> Potion. So, Shaman does not knock me down first. Yeah, here we go. Our first skill in this E of the Storm. Rock should have just continued because I cannot mind control mounted units. Oh, instead he decided so rot, and now he himself will rot in the Abyss. Next Druid. That's our third kill in the first minute. Oh, Shaman. That will be smarter this time. Yeah, he runs away. But a bit later, I found him again. Uh, oh, he is speed up. That means faster in Abyss. Oh no, we quite didn't make it. Let's finish it by knockback. Now let's throw down this druid. Look how happily he goes. That's our fifth kill. Oh, now this beast. Let's position him with mind control and then glide and knock. Well, it worked almost perfectly, but he is still alive. And we will count it as sixth kill only if he jumps down. Check priest. Yeah, he jumped down and he's down. Yeah. That makes total of six kill in this battleground. I am not only memeing, I have also top healing done, as you can see on the scoreboard. 
we will check one more E of this turn. First, let's wait for the power to come closer. Nice. That's first skill. Oh, warrior. It will be second. No. 30k that knight slowed him, so it will be a bit slower, but yeah, we got there. Oh. That was close. This death knight almost saved him. Oh well. Let's just go this one. But Hunter. Will he be out of search skill? Yes. We will move to the bottom of tower. Oh, that is too many healers. Oh, let's get rid of Mog. Uh, now the priest will die because monk cannot support him. Nice. There will be at least one person who will say I am trolling and not help with my team. But not only I was first in healing in whole battleground, I used only 20% of healing on me and 80% of healing on my teammates. Oh, is fire gone? That's out of fifth skill. Now we are retreating, but we can turn it around this timely mind control. This is sixth skill. Long. Seventh kill. And Warrior. Eight kill. Wow, yeah, the storm is really dangerous place, isn't it? That makes total of eight kills in this year of the storm. Option three. Gravity is a bitch. These two death knights are very annoying. Not anymore. Wait a second. Am I the one who is being annoying? Oh well. Despite my best efforts, we lost Lumbermill. So I corpse run and surprise these two paladins. One is knocked. Second is mind control. His reflex are... One second too late. Now we will cap it. And wait for our next victim. I have some rogue here. Yeah, he is mounted. I hope he will dismount so I can... Yeah, he dismounted and now I can mind control him. And jump. Uh, this one, I am 100% sure he died. Look at his hit points. And he's gone. Cool. Let's wait for another victim. Voila, mind control. Oh no, he bubbled in time. They are learning. You have to be careful. So we will use the second yeah. possibility and knock them. Ah. Now it's getting pretty intense. There is too many enemies. 5 DPS and one healer. I have to fake my death to buy us some time to recharge clockback and such.
my my stuff almost got knocked. Oh, this hunter is trying to cap. I don't think so. Yeah, and that's like seven people knocked down in this other field. Eight. Option four. Waterfall. Let's bait this row. Oh no, there are two. Oh, one again. <laughs> and zero rogues. Oh, that is so stoned warlock. How unfortunate that so stone will not help you uh, down in the abyss. Let's check the option 5. I included it only because I like 5 more than 4. MC from safe place. Technically, the other will kill him, but you know, I put him down, so it counts in my head. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, that's all for today.